to you. Martin Tyler here along with Alan Smith. Portuguese league action on the agenda for you today. Very shortly, Victoria Guimaraes against Porto. Well, what an arena we've got here. Perfectly suited to football and two very noisy sets of fans. What a backdrop that should be to what on paper should be a, an entertaining match. This game really is a chance for him to express himself. Brute strength this lad has got when he needs to show it. No defender can match him for that. This is the home team lineup. We've got it down as a 4 3 3. Yeah, it's a system that the Netherlands used to use all the time. I think really they invented it, and uh, plenty of countries have adopted it since. If it works, it's, it's really uh, tough to handle. Thank you. Enjoy and here is the, the team game. news for Porto. Marcano plays with Chancel Mbemba in defence. And they're going to go with one striker up front. Now the game has started. Diaz. They're looking good when they get the ball out wide, as they've done here. Chance for a break in numbers. Well, plenty of speed, but not much organisation. And the ball lost at a crucial time. No card, Alan. Maybe sensible from the referee this early. Yeah, they don't tend to like to flash the yellow card early on. But you could argue 15 minutes down the line, he would have been booked for that. Saved by the goalkeeper, that free kick. Corona. Teammates getting out of the way because they know he can dribble it here. I think the cross is on. Super header, narrowly wide. Yeah, the goalie was rooted to the spot there. Excellent challenge. Sergio Oliveira. And the forward could be played in. It was a lovely pass. Man coming in by the front post. Well, they put the squeeze on and got to finish here. It's bounced back into play from the bar. Here's Andre Andre. Agu. So close to taking the lead there, but the woodwork denying them. Just got to keep playing the way they are. Playing some good stuff at the moment. On the attack here. And that will be a corner. The referee has given a corner here. Teed up for a shot. Alex Teles, Sergio Oliveira. Chance for the cross. Oliveira. And here they are, still probing away. And the referee spotted that deflection. He's pointed for the corner.
corner played in. Defender did well to get to it, but hasn't really finished the job. How well saved. It's a corner coming up yet again. Corner swung in. Well, that's straight at the goalkeeper, and the attacking team will be annoyed with that. Break quickly when they get possession. And it's a shot now! That's a brilliant stop. And this is going to be a throw. Really important reading the danger there by the defender. The visitors having lots of the ball, but I don't think the manager will be happy down there watching this performance. And the referee looks to his assistant, who's got the flag up, it's offside. Agu. That's a great interception. Plenty of space out wide, and they're going to use it. Can go in from here. That's the shoot! Saved well by the goalkeeper. Corner given, and they'll be hoping to get this set piece right for a goal that will put them into the lead. Corner's taken. Only partially cleared, so there's still some problems for them. A great chance to go in front. Comfortable for the keeper. Three minutes, that's what's going to be played for added time. Of three minutes of Ami time. Andre, Andre. Not frightened at going for goal from a tight angle there. Yeah, it was tight, but he caught it well. Not a bad effort. Well, let's see what the ref's going to do. Shot's on here. The shot gets blocked. Trying to get in behind just a little too eagerly then. He could give the defender a yard, you know, and still get there. And there is the half-time whistle. Nil-nil at the break. And uh, the ball's on the centre spot. It's Porto who start the second half. It's a real opportunity to get it into the middle. Up for grabs here. Well, maybe the counter-attack is on here. I just keep thinking back to that save, Martin. I mean, you have to think it's only a matter of time before they do score, but... Wow. Steered through. Space for the shot! On the move and able to cut out the pass. Steady at best in the first 45 minutes, still 45 minutes to go, of course. Yeah, it was hard work for him in that first half. You could see him putting in the shift, but not much went right, and uh, he'll hope to improve in this second period. Porto in possession again. Have a look at what's on now from this wide position, not closed down. Defender blocks the cross. Well, suddenly they could be on the counter-attack. Great chance to go in front. He's blocked that well. Octavia. Intercepted here. Still got a bit to do, but this is promising. Throw for Porto. It's going to be a change for Porto.
Corona. Good reading of the play by the defender there at a time where his team were really under the cosh. Porto's throw. Corona, Ottavia, going forward well. Corona, that was a chance to really get in at the goalkeeper, running off the defender, but he's run offside. Well, Alan, here's the substitution now. He was pretty poor out there today. Limited chances, the defenders had the better of him all match. Anna. Bit of space to go forward into with the ball. Well, the referees decided to give the penalty, and it's a chance now to take the lead. Well, could be a vital decision this one in looking at it. I think he was correct in it. Penalty given but no extra punishment for the culprit. Yeah, I think that's fair enough. I mean, it was a foul, but uh, he's not denied an obvious goal-scoring opportunity there. And the manager's decided for a change of personnel. Oh, he's put it wide! Oh, my word, he's gone for the corner, but missed it by a little distance there. Diaz, Alex Teles, Uribe, here's Zay Luis, here they are still probing away, Uribe, Zay Luis, here's Danilo Pereira, well, that's a great block, well now it's a corner, and this late on it represents a chance. And it is a substitute coming on for an already booked player. In goes the corner. All Peters out rather for them. Chance for a break in numbers. And we're into the last five minutes now. And it's still goalless in this game. Here's Edwards. Davidson. And the defender tidies that up. Please give a round of applause for today's man of the match. Number eight. Ola That's great John. defending there, stopping that attack. Alex Telles. We'll see what's gone up for two minutes. Two minutes. Lucas Evangelista. Good challenge here. Well, after 90 minutes, the scores are level.